Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. As the title of this video suggests, we're discussing K-1 fiancé visas and the adjustment of status process. For those who are unaware, those who arrive in the United States in K-1 fiancé visa status have 90 days in which to get married and file for adjustment of status. Adjustment of status means changing from a non-immigrant K-1 visa over to an immigrant status, which is you know, sometimes referred to as a CR1 or an IR1 visa, but visa no longer is really the, the issue. That person is then a lawful permanent resident of the United States. They're granted a quote-unquote green card or I-551 document, and they are, they're then allowed to just remain in the United States for the foreseeable future. And now, bear in mind, you've still got to deal with what's called a lift of conditions or removal of conditions 90 days prior to the two-year anniversary of arrival in the United States. But the purpose of this video is timing with respect to getting into the U.S. and getting adjusted. So you need to be aware that you need to get married in that 90-day period and you need to file for adjustment. And this is extremely important because by filing for adjustment, it preserves that K-1 fiancé's status until a final determination with respect to that adjustment. So again, timing issues are critical with respect to the K-1, especially in an adjustment context. 